Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So, in this one, we are gonna go through of new title update 1.5.0 that is releasing tomorrow, so 22nd of February of 2022. And in my opinion, there is some interesting things in the patch notes, so let's take a look, shall we? Because this is the last title update before the dawn of Ragnarok. We are already getting some support for it and the size of this title update is depending of the platform anywhere from around 4 to 15 gigabytes. Also you don't need to wait in order to play this because your level is boosted automatically to 340 with predefined selection of gear and weapons. So if you have the expansion bought already on the 10th you can start playing it immediately. If you are playing it as well let me know by hitting the like. Next thing on our list for today, it is gonna be the stealth. Just remember to take this with grain of salt. Ubisoft has promised us to fix something. It hasn't go as planned and we have still broken stuff from the day one. So very much indeed, take it with grain of salt. Anything that is promised to be fixed, it might not be. And if it is, something else probably will be broken like every time. I haven't seen an update that would not fix something and at the same time break something. So <laughs> yeah, I'm very keen to see what is coming out from tomorrow. Moving on to the gameplay, we are getting Saga difficulty. Write your own Viking Saga without having to worry about the challenges of the stealth and combat. Also, some new changes on the assassination aspect of the game. Let's see, let's see what is gonna happen. And if you want to read the full article, I will leave link to Ubisoft's patch notes on their official website if you want to take a closer look into the description box down below. Now, now we are getting to the good stuff. I have highlighted three major points, at least for me. So, in the first section, we are having Eivor getting teleported randomly. So, we are of course talking about the mini yeets and maybe even the real yeats, where Eivor is thrown into the air, flying around with or without the boat. Also, under it we are having players can remain stuck in the boss fight if the dive of the Valkyrie is the finishing move. So that might indicate that the wings from the Night Rogue set, they might be removed. Stay tuned for more, I will be live streaming tomorrow and let's see if the wings, if they are removed. Point number two unable to use the fishing line so that is a major thing because yeah there is a quest that you need the fishing line well you don't need but it is highly recommended of using the fishing line when fishing also i'm not sure if we are getting back the fishing line tactic throwing go obstacles i'll leave a video card how to use it around now the point number three that is interesting in my opinion and I have experienced myself, Vain Dead ability not working properly when used on specific terrain or objects. So for example, if I'm in the house, if I'm in the some kind of platform, I'm using the Vain Dead. Yeah, enemies are still hitting me, detecting me. So I'm really keen to see if that is actually gonna be fixed. So I can do my weekly Ubisoft Connect reset without problems. On the bonus and one thing from the next point, I cannot wait. The river raids, some Vikings and raids. So everybody knows the loading screens, they are killing us and yeah, there should be a fix for that one when coming back from the river raids into the Ravenstorp. That should be decreased after this update. Also, some fixes are promised for the Tombs of the Fallen and Mastery Challenges. Also, if you are having troubles with the Mastery Challenges, let me know in the comments down below. I will leave a video card in the upper right corner right now. We have almost slashed our way through this video and it is time for the last thing I wanted to talk about about the new update in this video. So in the graphics, animation and audio, meteorites not being spawned in England. And as we can know, few players a month ago also, Joe Raptor was showing in his videos the things about the meteorites that are hitting randomly here and there and you are getting some iron and titanium out of them. Also, that could be a neat little farming trick if the exploit is still working. 
So, I will let you know when we are having those and if you can exploit them. But for now, let's roll the outro. Thanks for watching. Remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong. Hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and up and bye bye.